Whew. They could be guns. What do we got here? Buckshot 12. These look, these look like guns. I got two words for you. What they call me? All right, we're here at the flea market first thing in the morning, and here's Uncle Mike. Uncle Michael's always knee deep in the middle of everything. There's a truck that there's a truck that needs to be moved, and this is what Uncle Michael does. He's gonna yell at these people if they move. Uh, this old man better get away from me. Oh, he shook his hand. Hi, sir. How you doing? I'm, I'm Uncle Mike. I'm just, I'm just here to make sure stuff don't get out of control. Gotta get this lady in here so we can all get here. This is the first you'll ever see, ladies and gentlemen. The Salt Princess in a skirt. 11 a.m. I think the last time I wore a skirt was third grade. Huh? I think the last time I wore a skirt was third grade. All right, so we're out here selling our load we picked up yesterday. What do you think? Are we gonna make some money? Are you gonna get some customers? Are you, you gotta get out there and, and flag them in. Get, do a dance, get a little arrow, and be like. No? You don't want to do it? Use your little chicken suit or something? A little bit slow out here. I got both of them working, so we might as well go see if we can find something. Let's pick the flea market. Nice little bikes there. That unicycle will be fun to try. <laughs> what are you doing? You put a little bit of work in? No, it's just nobody really shopping. So we're gonna pack up and go pick up more stuff. So this is that time. What do we got in the garage box? Whoo, look at that. Is that tape? Do my eyes deceive me? That is one of the most hidden gems you can ever find in a storage unit. If you're an eBay, that's eBay gold. We will keep that. Backyard full of supplies. Probably is exactly what it says, so they had a pool. It explains all the extravagant patio stuff. Ooh, what are these? Uh, those are those citronella candles. Huh. A lot of hot tub and pool stuff. Outdoor mosquito candles. Those are actually kind of good. If you have any kind of bugs, you know how annoying mosquitoes can be. So. We will keep those. And the rest is just trivial stuff. Miter saw tools. All right. Who doesn't like tools, right? What is a miter saw? What is a miter saw used for? Do you know that? Comment below right now. Miter saws are used for this, pirate. What's the last thing you used your miter saw on? If you were to speculate that question. That looks like a chop saw. Okay. These, what are these nails? I need some screws, so we was gonna, I think this is the miter saw right here. Right now, if you think this is the miter saw, comment 64. If you think that's the miter saw, comment 82. Doorknobs, lovely. This one has no words on it. I like no words. No words give a good mystery. Like that's why I think people hide their jewelry at is in no words. Let's see what we got here. We got a guess purse. Can you guess how much that is? No. Ooh, do I see coach? Do I see Ooh, who are these? All oh, these things have been worn to all hell and back. Look at that. She was wearing the heck out of this. All right. Placement bulb, snowman, an LED light. Those are good for Christmas. LED is always good. Ooh, an Xbox controller. Can that be a sign that we're gonna have 
an Xbox somewhere? Where am I at here? Can you see that? Can you see that? That's a good sign. Ooh, look at that. Michaela's gonna start having change for her next. Michaela's getting change for her next um, coin star video. You guys ever watch Michaela Jordan D. Haas's coin star videos? You have to go to the Salt Princess channel, uh, the Salt Princess, and subscribe to her channel. Eddie Bauer, that's a good brand too. Nothing in there. See all that change down there? Where's it at? Can you see it right there? That's a decent looking box. Got some painting trays. Ooh, look. Cheese. Cheese. Those are not Ralph Lauren's. Old love letters. Putty. Label maker. A light. A whole bunch of nada. <laughs> Ooh, those are cute. Look at those, little polos, Ralph Lauren polos. Come on, we got another one, let's be another one. Ooh, ooh. Come on, be daddy's million dollars. Nope. What do you think's in here? Are the shoes in here? What do you think? On 6,432. And go. Boom, shakalaka, we got. Oh, those are dope. I would rock those, those are my size. I would totally rock those. Can't, what is a Scentsy Pot actually, before I open this box, anybody know right now, can you tell me? What is a Scentsy Pot? That's probably what one is right there. Look everybody, we got paper. A spoon collection. I see a spoon collection. This must be a Scentsy candle here. Oh, this is wall decor right here. Empty mini marshmallows, wonderful. I always like to keep my empty mini marshmallow containers too for later when I want to refill them with other mini marshmallows. my cold. Oh, don't take it personal. I thought I said wall decor. I'm not sure. Oh, look, it's a little kitty. Yep. bunch of nothing look at that a, just a lot Ooh, a diamond we found an extremely huge diamond ladies and gentlemen we don't have to might not have to work anymore now these are uh, souvenir spoons they look like a president's there's a uh, one of the greatest presidents ever right there jfk shout out to him hey danbury man let's look real quick something like that please be something fan. mbi I don't know what that is. Comes in a double-sided container. The rest of this is kind of trivial. We got a candle holder. I'm not gonna go in through all this. I can't do it. What do we got here, candle? Yes, yeah, an electric sensor candle burner. I know exactly what these are now. Okay. This one's intrigued me, it says special ornaments. Ooh, let's see what I think is a rat 
you know anything about diamonds, you know Radco is good money. Are they Radco? Nope, they're cheap. They're Walmart knockoff Radco ornaments. Look at that. Still nice though, don't get me wrong. That's Santa. Looks like all ornaments. Not impressed. Hand painted. All star house. Alright. What do we have in here? Let's just, let's just see. Let's just well, let's see what day and news this was. I always like to do that. That's a Christmas thing. I'm more intrigued by this. It was January 14th, 2006. A Alito, hearing ends, but fight goes on. Look, he's doing a fist bump. Whoever Lee he is right here. He's fist bumping everybody in this ussy with uh, Senator Arlen Specter left talks of Patrick Leahy. All right, interesting. DNA pardon shake justice system. Okay. Paperwork. Ooh, look at this paperwork. Bio red, somebody must have worked for them. CDs. Mariah in sync. No. Integration, Sun Educational System, Unix, Classified Colors. We got a coach bag. There's like coach and everything. All coach everything. Hello. Good morning. Ooh, we do have something coaches. I like it. Every box has something coach to offer. That is a cute little coin purse, ladies and gentlemen. That is cute. Look at that. So cute. Is that what Michaela Jordan would say? No, because they're not trues. Whew. Do we have something in here? Look. What is this? In this little bag. This is just ridiculous. Look at that. Somebody really liked their coach. I'm just going to say it right now. Somebody really liked their coach. We're just getting coach after coach after coach after coach of things. Okay, where'd my knife go? Oh, Lord. Yes. Craigs, polo shirts, long sleeves. DK and Y clothes. Not bad. Size medium, extra medium. This is like a boring box of clothes. Oh, here we go. Here we go. First off, what do we have here? 1978. Now what do we have? Look at this. A Rangers jersey. That's kind of cute. I guess it wouldn't be cute. It's kind of rugged. It's nice and sexy. Handsome. Starter. Large. What do we got here? This is looking uh, like another one. Molson Ice. Ice Brew Beer. I thought this was a jersey. It's a number 94. CCM. I don't know what this goes for. Then we got what looks like Nighthawks. Number 73. This, I don't know what this is. This is just the jersey. The Nighthawks. Still cool. Now, continuing along. That, that got excited. Oh, here we go. Now we're getting some stuff with tags. What do we got here? All funny. It's a long sleeve shirt. Doesn't have a, doesn't have anything on it, but we'll set that aside in the good pile. Come on, vintage concert t-shirts. West Coast Choppers, there you go. Shout out to West Coast Choppers. That was a thing once. And that's it for, oh, we got, ugh. Sick. Broncos, ew. Throw up emoji. Romanowski. The X-49er though. Give you credit on that. At least you did one thing right in your football career. I'm gonna get all sorts of negative comments now for that, but I'm not a Broncos fan, so so what? 
What do we got here with the price tag on it? Something has a price tag on it. Colo. That's almost cool. It's down to $7.99. You save 66%. It's a 2XL. Okay. What is this right here? H and H men. That's kind of cool. Large. Caleb will probably watch it like that. And we got a soccer jersey. Is that what that is? A soccer jersey? Italia? Seven. It's a good number. Del Piero. Gap. $16.50 for this. One new shirt in the box. Or, I don't know what the heck I said that for. What do we got here? Some of these shirts are kind of cool. I love New York. Nice. That's a good shirt. Never even wore it. He obviously didn't love New York. He just bought the shirt and didn't want to show the love. H&H, &H, man, I could see Michaela liking that one. It's blue. She kind of likes blue. What do we got here? I was here. Okay, I don't like that one. I didn't go there, so I can't really represent like I was there. I'm not trying to front. <laughs> the Pistons, really? Nice. The Bulls, I can understand the Bulls. My other favorite team. From back when I named my daughter after Michael Jordan. Alright, that was kind of a cool box of clothes. Oh, pardon me. Are those Beagle Boys you're wearing? Who remembers that co uh, commercial? Comment below right now. Gotta come up on stage. The whole concert would stop and they'd be like, Excuse me, are those Beagle Boys you're wearing? How is this unit for? I don't know. I spent 3700 on four units. I hope I read the, what those words said, ladies and gentlemen. If I didn't, I hope you read it because then you will know. Okay, we got Craig's pants. Craig had some really... What the hell kind of pillow is this? What are you doing with this? Oh, it's a skirt. Never mind. Sorry, Craig. Banana Republic. Banana Republic's good. Those look vintage-y. Have you ever seen that before? This must be made in another country or something. They're, well, they're obviously made in China. But I've never seen Levi's with that label. Andy, what size pants are you? 40, 34. Here's some 14. Ooh, what do we got here? A little bit of something, something. Someone was, someone was shopping at Victoria's Secret. Woohoo! Look at that. Victoria's Secret. Huh? Take that Not me. What do we got here? Ooh, Lacoste. Look at this right here. This is money, I think. I saw Lacoste. I can promise you this is probably good money on eBay. I can't make super good promises, but just like a half a promise. Lacoste is a cool little vintage brand. That one's made in the Philippines. Yeah. I know that was a Gucci belt for a second there. H&M, I feel like h and is a good brand. I have to set that aside, I don't know why. My mind is telling me that. In the back corner here. I'm excited, I'm excited. I don't know what those are. Whew. They could be guns. Look at that. I'll tell you one thing. There's a box right here. It says glass candles. And look, it's not glass candles. What do we got here? Empty shells. Buckshot 12. Buckshot 12. A lot of Buckshot 12. Sluggers. Buckshot 12s. Classic. Constitution. There we go. See that? All sorts of shotgun shells. Huh. What if that's a sign of what's in those boxes there? That'd be crazy. That'd be crazy. It looks like we're making a trip to the FFL. Let's see what we got here. Huh. 
Huh, that's a gun. Ooh, these look, these look, these look like guns. Are these guns? Let's see. This. What is that word right there? What is that word? What is that? That is a shotgun. That is a Remington, Remington 870 Express. Isn't that something? We actually found a shotgun. Let's see if it has anything in it. Nope. Wow. Looks like we're going to the FFL with this. Dang, that is sweet. 12 gauge shotgun and whatever this is gonna be. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. What is that? Ooh, we got a rifle. Model 740. Looks like there's nothing. How do we make this one go back? No bullets in the chamber. Nice. Looks like I'm taking a trip to the... Uh... To the desert. No, the going to the gun place. place. You go to the FFL, you give them 60 bucks a gun and they make them legal. Oh. Yeah. That's nice. A Remington. I don't know. I have to look it up. This is a. This is a thirty odd six. That's probably pretty good. Anybody out there right now? Comment below what you think this is going to be worth. We've got a thirty odd six Remington seven forty, and the other one was a Remington shotgun twelve gauge eight seventy. Wow. It's almost eight o'clock at night. I'm still out here trying to get loaded for Stockton Wednesday. Got one vault almost done, one pod. Got another pod almost done. and trying to get this in there so I can call it a day. And that's a wrap. We're done for today. A little bit of cleanup tomorrow. Take a little bit of these boxes back to my storage for an unboxing in the toolbox. The rest goes to Stockton. That's a wrap. That is a wrap.